Hi, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and I'd like to welcome you to my channel. Yeah, Today we're going to be uh, featuring homemade, my homemade um, meat um, spaghetti and meat with meat sauce. And I'd like to take you through the steps. Uh, so uh, all the steps, there's um, uh, all my steps to how I got from beginning to end. So if you stay tuned, I hope I can uh, show you that future. Thank you. And... Okay, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and I would like to show you guys how I made this homemade spaghetti uh, I, I, and all the ingredients that I put in it from start to finish. So stay tuned, and I will show you all the ingredients in the whole entire step-by-step -step process. And that process is coming up right now, right here yes, on the Bonnie yeah, Hawkins make, channel. Uh, a spaghetti, um, and these are the ingredients that I'm using. I'm using, um, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and I'm preparing to make a, a, some homemade spaghetti here for my, um, anyway, so I'm using, um, of course, my ground beef and onions and a little bit of uh, chopped uh, green peppers in there and, and a little bit of noodles, and uh, there's my pasta mix, and there's the ingredients I'm using, um, and you, as you can see, um, I'm using a little bit of uh, garlic, which I like garlic, so I'm using a little garlic pepper, and regular salt and pepper, and a little seasonal oil, um, a, little, a little bit of um, oregano, and I, I like the, uh, the allspice, so I'm having a little, putting a little of that in there, and of course there's my my uh, tomato paste and uh, tomato sauce and and all the ingredients all the ingredients are right here um, I'm about to uh, get it all started and uh, and now we're gonna have a nice little nice little prepared a nice little prepared meal this is Bonnie Hawkins and preparing a little meal spaghetti and and all right there uh, the uh, chopped onions and a little green pepper mixed in and uh, ground beef and all my pasta sauces and things other things the noodles and the uh, tomato sauce and paste and the, uh, the garlic powder and the uh, oregano spice, a little salt and pepper, and and all of the other things you see here. I even dab, I put a little dab of sugar in my in my uh, in my spaghetti as well to give it a little extra taste. And uh, so uh, anyway, these are the ingredients that I'm working with. And all right, and I'll show you the finished results. Again, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and this is a. Uh, a little meal I'm preparing and the ingredients that's going to go in my spaghetti so check with you guys again soon okay this is Bonnie Hawkins again and I got my I got my as you can see I got my for my spaghetti I got my spaghetti um, the ground beef and the onions and, and um, a, little, a little bit of uh, green pepper and and I uh, got two two things going at the same time, the exact same thing, and I'm trying to, um, okay, so I got this, as you can see, you see, I like to make all of my, prepare my, my, um, the beef and stuff, I have all that all squared away first, and of course the, the noodles will be the last thing to cook, and then you, uh, blend all your stuff together and you all your, your, your uh, spices there, still there, and your pot ready for the noodles right there. Uh, ready for that, and, but not quite yet. So right now we're just going to uh, let these uh, and let all this um, do its thing, and then we're going to have a good old. Good old, um, 
homemade spaghetti. Okay. Okay, that's really cooking up real good. So we got that. Yeah, it's cooking up real good. So we're getting that on. And that is just the, um, the onions, the ground beef, and a little green pepper. And I'm going to, in a few minutes, we'll start putting some of the seasonings in. And, uh, and, uh, and then I'm going to get the noodles straight and combine everything together with the pasta sauce and the spices and everything. And this is Bonnie Hawking. Like I said, I got all this other stuff. I got. I'm going to make the ingredients and things that's going to go in here. And um, it's cooking up good so far. So, and again, this is Bonnie Hawkins preparing a nice uh, spaghetti dinner for my family. And also, I'm going to try to. Uh, I'm going to. I haven't decided on whether I'm just going to have buttered, hot buttered rows or or more cornbread or just what to have along with it. But most likely, we're just going to have some. Nice uh, hot buttered rose with this meal. Okay. Okay. Now we got um, the uh, the ground beef and onions and salt and um, green pepper and everything all ready for my for my spaghetti and. I put all my ingredients all here, and those are all the ingredients that I, I use. And uh, and I'm gonna stir this, mix this together. I always like to mix my stuff ahead of time, cause then I get to taste it and see what you know, see if it's the taste that I like. And and uh, then I put my ingredients in my pan. And once I get it at the taste I like, and and. Uh, And then I put it in, and uh, I get a little dab of taste it, and I better taste a little bit before I put the come. All right, taste. Okay, okay. So now I'm going to combine. I'm gonna turn the temperature down on this little pan here. I'm gonna combine the ingredients, and then I'm gonna let it simmer. Symbol, symbol. I'm sitting here trying to hold my phone and talk at the same time. Let's see if I can do this without, without dumping everything on the ground, on the floor. Alright, so anyway, here we go. I got most of it out there. But you guys get to see. You, you know what I'm talking about, right? The pan was kind of heavy for me to be handling <laughs> with I, two hands. So, anyway, so we got the spaghetti sauce in here. I'm gonna stick, got more to go in, but I, I gotta set the camera down to do that. Maybe I can't. Let me see. Maybe I can do it. So we got all the sauces in. Now we're gonna let that assemble. I'm gonna cover it up and let it assemble for a while while the, uh, the, uh, the noodles will be, uh, cooking as well. There's the noodles. I haven't put them in yet. I got the pan of water boiling right now on the uh, on the stove here. Yeah, I've got to excuse my mess. I kind of waste spills a little while I was going with this, trying to do everything with one hand. But, you know, you get the idea, right? That's, just, that's going to be the spaghetti. Spaghetti sauce and the spaghetti, uh, the meat and the onions and green pepper and and of course, like I said, my seasonings and and uh, which uh, garlic I like garlic. I put a little garlic in and a little a little dab of sugar. And I even stick a little bit of a, a little barbecue sauce in it, just a little teeny bit to give that extra tangy taste. 
and I like my Hungarian hot hot uh, I even put a little bit of that in there and occasionally I'll stick a little bit of chili powder in uh, in it as well you know and, and I like my all seasonings and, and I like uh, my um, of course your tomatoes paste and all the other ingredients and uh, so anyway we're we're working on it this is Bonnie Hawkins okay it's been uh, simmering for a while and then I turned the burner up a little bit more so that uh, so that it uh, what you call but again that's this is a sauce for my spaghetti homemade spaghetti this is Bonnie Hawkins of course and uh, see I put I like uh, a lot of chunky meat, ch meat chunks in there so as you can see I got my meat ch chunks and a little bit of diced potatoes, I mean, I mean, diced, I'm sorry, diced tomatoes even in it. I like mine, to, I like my spaghetti to be, be uh, nice and perky for me and my, and my family here. Okay, so, alright, I'm going to put the top back on it. And okay, so I got my ingredients ready, I got my, uh, of course that's been boiling. And I've got the, um, some spaghetti, my homemade spaghetti, all, all squared away, just waiting, the, the sauce and the, and the, and the beef, I got all that ready, and my pan ready to receive the, uh, I like to put, um, the spaghetti noodles, as well as a little bit of the regular macaroni noodles in mine, sort of like a little, um, what do they call that? I forgot what they call it. Here you are. I got this is my ingredients that's going to go in, and and there's my pot of water ready to receive the 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 noodles here. And uh, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and getting close to the finished product here. Um, and uh, we're we're about to very shortly wrap this up homemade spaghetti and meat sauce and uh, we're about this is Bonnie Hawkins we're about, about ready to get the noodles in the pot and and get everything all squared away and, and we're gonna serve it with hot butter rose and this will be for dinner Okay, it seemed like it's a little steam here because I got a little light shining. But uh, anyway, there's my pot. So now it looks like my, um, here's my pot. This is Bonnie Hawkins. There's my pot for my spaghetti, uh, homemade spaghetti. It looks like the, uh, um, the water is boiling quite a bit now. So I'm going to add my noodles in and let them cook. Okay, so we got the noodles added to the pot, and that's getting ready to, um, we don't let that cook, and, and then the spaghetti and meat sauce, homemade, is, is right there beside it. And uh, we're going to let it, um, let that spaghetti cook, and then we'll be all ready to have a meal. This is Bonnie Hawkins. All righty. Homemade spaghetti and meat with meat sauce. Okay, that's coming along pretty good. And uh, we're going to let that go ahead. And that's the noodles. We're going to let that go ahead and cook up well. And, uh, and when that's ready, bon appetit. Yes, uh, the spaghetti noodles almost ready. I got them. They're in here. Uh, this is Bonnie Hawkins. And the noodles for the spaghetti, the homemade spaghetti. And the noodles are, as you can see, are still. And I got the noodles. I got the, as I said before, I got the, um, I like to use two types of noodles in my homemade spaghetti. The majority of the time I use a little bit of macaroni noodles. Uh, 
I try to put the big macaroni in it to make it look a little bit like garlic. I mean, uh, what is that called? Goulash uh, noodles. I call it goulash noodles. But I seem to run out of those. But this will do. And uh, again, so all that's cooking up real good. And uh, very shortly, it'll be ready. And the only way I have to combine the spaghetti. Now, I don't know how you guys do things, but I like to actually put my noodles in my in my spaghetti sauce. And I usually like to allow that to kind of set for a while. That's just me. The majority of the time, that's how I do it. But everybody's to each his own how they do things. But this is how I like to do mine most of the time. Okay, so that's going to uh, do its thing for a little while longer. Well, okay, I'm going I'm about to um, take the spaghetti, and this is Bonnie Hawkins, and I'm about to take the spaghetti uh, um, noodles that I just cooked. And I've cooked, as you can see, my um, spaghetti and meat um, um, sauce earlier, and uh, but uh, we are ready, so I'm going to pour the, as you can see, I'm pouring the noodles in the strainer. Here to kind of okay, you see, and um, and I forgot to add, uh, mention that I put a little bit of a uh, you put a little of uh, it's good, I think, to put a little of a little oil like cooking oil, a little cooking oil in, in the there when you're cooking your noodles, that'll stop them from uh, clogging up, but anyway. Uh, again, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and you got all kinds of steam coming from the, the that. And I, the way I like to do things is I'm going to move this pan out of the way, first of all. And uh, you may not can see it that clear right now, but that is the, that is the um, the spaghetti noodles. Okay, and what I usually like to do is take and move my pan out of the way there, and I take my bowl here. And I empty my noodles in that. Just some of them in there. And because I like to, for those who don't want um, who don't want their noodles to be mixed in with the, let me move this out of the way here. Okay, for those who don't like their noodles to be mixed in the spaghetti sauce, I, I keep a little extra here. Or, or if I use it all up and someone decide they want that like that, I'll put a fresh pot in. But that is the spaghetti. And there's the extra noodles. I'll set back here. And uh, there's those extra noodles. And what I do now, and I'll take my sauce. As you can see, there's the sauce I made, homemade. And I pour some in there, like that. And it looks like I'm making a little bit of a mess. Uh, but then I just take it. Stir it in. See how that is? I'll stir that in real good. And that's the spaghetti and the, the homemade spaghetti and that I just made. And, I'm, and I, I like a lot of sauce in my stuff, so I'm going to put a little, little more sauce in there. 
I still have so my homemade sauce made. As a matter of fact, I'm going to dump it all in. How about that? And, uh, and I'll make extra for if someone wants their stuff just to be poured over. I can always make extra. I have ex all the extra ingredients to do that over again. I do extra for the extra um, noodles. But that's it. This is Bonnie Hawkins, and uh, that's my homemade spaghetti. And I'll serve it up with my hot rose and and um, and uh, that's pretty much it. So I got a little close up for you guys. That is a. It looks a little bit of what you come because as you can see, I just mixed it all up here together and got it all straight. This is Bonnie Hawkins and here is my finished homemade spaghetti and meat and meat. Okay. And I'm gonna I'm just gonna wipe the little I'm just going to wipe the little edges of the pan off here. You know, when you're making homemade stuff, sometimes things get, get, get a little splattered. You know what it's all about. So anyway, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and there's my homemade spaghetti. I'm, as you can see, I'm splattering stuff again. But you get to see it. There it is. Okay, this is Bonnie Hawkins, and there's my homemade, uh, you can see, there it is, that's, that's Bonnie Hawkins' homemade spaghetti for her fam, for the, for my family. God bless you all. This is Bonnie Hawkins signing off.